hi welcome to my youtube channel my name is karen prince thank you for clicking on this video today i'm just going to share with you how i achieved this side high ponytail with a little twist so go ahead and keep watching to see how i get this look okay so what i'm going to do first is I've already started to part my hair going diagonally like towards my eyebrow and I'm just creating a section for that side detail that I created. So that's what I'm doing here and then the other side I'm just making that part go down towards my ear. So that's how I section that off and then I'm going to go ahead and just put that away. So at this point, I'm just kind of checking out how my head is looking and trying to see where exactly I want the side ponytail to go. Just make sure when you're brushing your hair, it's going in a side way, like in the opposite direction. You want to brush your hair away from the side detail to make it stand out more. Okay, so I'm only using two products in this video. Right here is the Curl Enhancing Smoothie by Shea Moisture. And the other product that I'll be using is the Eco Styler Gel, the olive oil one, which you'll see me pick up later. Now you're just gonna wanna smooth this product all along the edges of your hair and along the edges of your part. Now taking the Eco Styler Gel, I'm going to do the same exact thing. Okay, so taking my bristle brush, I'm just going to begin to brush my hair up into my ponytail. Okay, now I'm just gonna take my hair tie and I'm gonna put my hair into that ponytail. And then I'm gonna go ahead and use my brush and my gel and my curl enhancing smoothie. And I'm just gonna add more product and brush it along wherever I need to. So you'll know where you'll need more product. Just make sure your hair is pretty smooth, guys. You want it to be slick. And I just went ahead and readjusted my ponytail. I wanted it to be a little higher. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and create this side design and I'm gonna go ahead and just make a part going straight back. And I'll just be making three sections for this side detail. Okay, so to slick these sections, I'm just using the same exact products that I use for the rest of my head. And in the same way, just putting it along the parts. And then I'm going to go ahead and use a um, baby hair brush or smaller brush and brush it into each section. And I'm going to do that for all three sections. And then I'm going to secure each section with the rubber band. Okay, so I'm just kind of touching up my edges some more with this little spoolie because it's softer than that other brush. What I do want to tell you guys is that when you are creating these um, sections and you brush your hair into the section, brush your hair back away from your face so that it's going in the opposing way in which you brushed your hair into the larger ponytail because you want these sections to stand out and you want them to be smooth and stuff and you want it to like um, just be able to be distinct. You don't want the part lines to be blurred with any hair or anything like that. So just take your time and be as neat as possible and make sure you just take your time, yeah. And as you see me doing, I'm just taking the section from the first ponytail and connecting it to the second one and I'll do the same thing for the last one. And then you're going to want to put your um, design and connect it into your ponytail. Okay. 
Okay, so now I'm just gonna braid my ponytail and I'm going to add on a ponytail that I made that's detachable. I have a video on that. I'll put an I card up here. And also, I'm just gonna continue to smooth my hair and put more gel where I need to and just fix my baby hairs up and stuff before I put my ponytail on. Okay, so here is the ponytail and I am just attaching it just like this. Guys, if you haven't seen my video on how I create these ponytails, please go check it out. They're so, such a joy. Like I really love them and they're so easy to apply. Okay, so now I'm gonna section off a piece from that ponytail and I'm just going to brush through it, put a little gel on it, and I'm going to wrap this around the base of my ponytail, keeping that section as flat as possible, just so that it will look smooth. And I wanted to create a wider band this time, that's why I'm using such a big piece. And yeah, just wrap it around just like that. And then bobby pin the end to secure it. And that is it guys. That is how I created this style. I'm just fluffing through this hair a little bit, pulling it apart and just making it a little bit more fluffy to my liking. And yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, if you have any questions for me, please leave your questions down in the comment section. Thank you for watching and see you next time guys. Bye.